Well, I agree with you uh, about Newt. Uh, he's kind of a retread. I'm tired of holding my nose voting for uh, Newt. And, uh, well, let's see, Bob Dole and McCain. Really tired of that. And my utopia that will never happen. This is, it will never happen, okay? But if you're applying for a job in government, an elected job, and you're in an elected job, my utopia would be you cannot campaign at all for this job until you've signed off on your other job. In other words, uh, if you are a governor of a state, that's, that's what you were elect elected to do. You should do this until the point you decide you don't want to seek the job of presidency, let's say, and be required to resign as governor of whatever state it is, and uh, then you can begin your campaign. Don't get me wrong, you can, uh, you know, voice your opinion of what president is doing or whoever you know whoever the job is doing but you can do fundraisers this and that you know and and collect money to campaign against this individual and this even goes to the president okay now if you're a president your campaign is in front of the people this is what you're doing. So, unless you're interested in signing the job over to the vice president, you should be able, you, you should have to stick with what you're doing and not spend a dime campaigning against anybody. It was your opinion, but no fundraisers, for you, no, I'm sorry. Nothing like that. Unless you want to resign from the position you're doing. Because people have hired you to do a certain job. When you're campaigning, you're not doing that job anymore. I'm just saying, you know, it's it's my two cents worth. Keep uh, change and go on if you want. But that's my opinion.